Right, good morning everyone. Um, I'm going to do a tutorial. Now, I have to tell you, we do have this in the store. And we've got it in. I'll show you the colours. Um, let me just get the colours. We've got it in this colour, a really rich petrol jadey green. The wine, of course. And then we've got it in the jade. And it's gorgeous. So let me just sort this out. Um, the squares are probably about uh, 18 to 20 inch squarish, if you know what I mean. Oh, well, this is the size, which is big enough to do a book or whatever you want to do. So I'm going to do something with mine today. Um, but what I'm going to do is just trim mine at the moment. So just bear with me. Come on. I only need half a piece. So I've got enough to make a book if I want to. A book cover. See, so I'm just going to move that to one side for a minute. So I've got a piece here. Right, now what I want to show you as well is we've got these in the shop. Uh, well, they will be in the shop shortly. Those... And where's the others? Oh, here they are. Those. Let me just make sure you can see. So we've that style, that one, and that one. This is in three inches, four inches, four inches. Okay? So they're the new doilies that are spare that can go in the shop. Now, I'm just going to move them out of the way because there's plenty of them. And uh, I will be doing that shortly. When I say they're in the shop, they will be in the shop shortly. Now... Let me just see. I need a pencil. I need a white pencil. I'm going to fold my fabric in half. I don't actually need that much anyway. Let me just see. That should be enough and that will leave me a strip to do something else with. I think. Okay, dokie. Let me just try this. Now where's my pencil sharpener? Right, so let me just get this right so I can. I don't want to be stretching all the time. It does me head in. <laughs> so we're going to put this here. Now, um, let's just see. Now I can alter this if I'm not happy with it. And I'm happy with it. I might take that that way, actually. To give me more on the foot. Like that. Am I happy with that? This needs to come out more. And that, I'm not happy with this. Yes, I think that's fine. Okay, should we get my other scissors? Sorry.
And there we go, keep that because you never know when that might come in handy. And we can get rid of the bits and pieces that we don't need. Okie dokie. Right. Yeah. So now we've got that, which is my shoe. And we've got that to sit on there. Okay. Now let's have a look, see where we're at. Right here. So what I'm going to do first of all is to do the top section. And we'll leave the gap there. Yeah, I think we'll do that. There we go for now. Okie dokie, we've got that. And then the gap I've got here, which is what I'm going to use to actually fill it. So, let me just get a ink rod in. Okay, put my pencil away, don't need that now. Take my little stick and just use small amounts. And the bit I'm going to use at uh, fill first is this top section. Now, some of it has got a little bit more than I care to have, so I'm just going to wandle it about. But I basically got what I needed, which is a little shoe. Like that. We can wandle all that. Oops, it's opened up there, so let's just poke that back in. This is the thing, you've just got to work carefully with it, and then uh, eventually it will work. Time... And patience okay so which way do I want my shoe do I want my shoe that way I'm just going to trim that section off I don't like that yeah that looks more like a heel I could have made this section a lot bigger and deeper to be honest but I didn't so that's my fault so now what I'm going to do remove the wadding I mean it doesn't look much now but it will she says. Right, so what I'm going to do now, because this will definitely help to seal um, you just go around the edge 
like that. Take it around. Remember what I said to you when you go around an edge, just ease it in. Ease that in like that. I'm just going to continue with this. Like I say, we're coming round to a curved section again. And you just ease it in, just do that. I know it's going to loop, but then if you push down and push out, it will look like that and it will sort itself out. You just have to ease it. And then all I'm going to do is just join that section there. So I'm just going to snip that like that. I mean, I need to snip it again, but we'll see. Just ease that in. And then I'm just going to flip that like that. And it will join that section. And just glue that into place. So we've got that, and it's um, so that can be. I mean, it, it, this is really bending. I should have pushed that fabric in there a bit more. But um, on the other side, if you're only using it like a pin cushion or for decoration or to hang, you know, you don't need to do much with it. I actually have done mine. I would have preferred it that way, <laughs> but never mind. Done it that way now. What I could do is go or uh, do the same on the opposite side, but I'm not going to because. I'm only showing you how to do it. So if you make one, you can do that if you want to. Uh, so now, I think I want some lace from here. Gorgeous lace, which we do sell in the shop and we're plenty of it. Like that, so I'm just gonna cut a piece. Now I will need my needle and thread because I need to gather this. So we'll do that, and that's given that like a tuft. Like that. Now I've got in my little bag somewhere, in my little, um, here we are, where's the other one gone? Hey. I've got some bits and pieces that I can use. So I could, oh, that'd look really pretty, wouldn't it? But I'm not sure. Yeah, let's just see what this one is. 
Do I, I think I prefer that. So I'm just going to take this flower off. And I'm going to glue onto that this acrylic flower. And I'll show you why. Because in there, I'm going to put some glue. And then, I've got that beautiful bead. And I want that to go here. I hope you can see this. And I just think that's going to look far better. Yeah. Like that. Now I do have... Um, let me just get it. I need to get a tassel. A pink tassel. Oh, and I've got several of those. I think I'll choose the darker pink. Ah, let's have a look. Uh, let's put them in there. I'm going to choose the darker pink. Take that off. Now, I need to put that on there. Yes. So that has to hang here. And then what I'm going to do, I'm not sure if I've, I could use that. Mm, all that. No, that. <laughs> I'm actually going to alter the flower and I've changed my mind. Which is the best thing about crafting because that's what you can do. So I've just put one of my favourite flowers on there. Um, and I'm just going to take that off again. Like that. Change my mind. Pop that back in my box. Um, I need to put that flower back in shape. Like that. And I'm going to use one of my all-time favourite flowers to go in there. Like that. Yeah. So that's got my little tassely bit on there. Um, and what I could do, I'm not sure that I'm going to. I do have, let me see. I'm not sure if I want to do that. No, I don't want to do that. Hmm. Let me see. This is all, you know, uh, what you. There's lots of things you can. I like I want a bow on it. How. I could do that, couldn't I? Oh, I, oh, I know what I'm going to do. Oh. I know what I'm going to. Yes. But do you know what? And I know you're going to cringe, but you'll have to cringe. <laughs> I'm just going to put one there. I don't want it stuck out, you see, there's no point. And one there, and then I'm gonna pin them down. So I don't want them stuck out. Like that. Do I need another one? Sorry about that, sorry. But you know what, I've got these as well. Oh, now I like that. All right, okay, so we're not going to waste that little diamante thing. Let's take that off. 
that'll be hard to glue on this what I'm going to do look I like the idea to enhance that bow I like that yes so it's got bow lace bow I like that better now let's have a look I don't need them bits anymore um, but what I might do no they're too big what have I got oh, I've got a bit of this a little bit of this. I use this a lot, you see, for my uh, crafting. And what I'm going to do is just sit it underneath there. So I'm just going to just under that flower. Oops, a daisy. Lift. Oh, I'll shove all that in there. Maybe we don't need that much. Now I'm going to put that bit on actually. And then what you can do is you just bend it back whenever you want it. Do you know, I'm not quite, I think it's that section that's bugging me. So I'm just going to cut down that section. That's better. It was just bugging me and I think that bit is as well. That's much better. Now we can now spread. That's it. Just a little bit better than what it was. Now a lot of people, they can go too far with them. They can, you know. But I don't like to do that. But what I do have, and I've got some here. And I... They came from a bracelet or something. Well, actually, I've got them in pearl as well, so we could actually do a, a mixture of the two. Let's have a look. Well, I've got some of those as well. Yeah, could you? In fact, I might use those because they're all in with what I want. So what I'm going to do, I've got these little flowers and they're diamante, metal diamantes with pearls in, pink pearls. And I just think they will look nice spotted about on the shoe. As, um, as a decoration. Like a jewelled shoe. Oh, that was my stomach. I'm terribly sorry. <coughs> I have eaten. It's just... Like a bejeweled shoe. How's that? They don't have to be in any particular order. One more I need. Oh, yes, got another one here. I 
um, and I think we'll put it offset like that. There. And um, that's how you do it. <laughs> I just wanted to make a little shoe. Now, I'll tell you what else I've got. I've got some of this. It's pink, flat back pearl. And um, I'm just going to cut a little... Let me just straighten it a little bit because it's a bit old. Like me. And what I'm going to do is just to add a little bit to the tassel section. Right, because um, I think it needs a little bit more. Adding to it. Uh, one more, I think. Just to add a little bit more flatter pearl to it. Yeah, I'm quite happy with that. And there you go. Yours might turn out totally different. Um, but I'm happy with what I've done. And how it's... Uh, might do one more there. Yeah, I've got another one. Okay, just there. That's it. More in, you know. Yeah, I like that. So I hope that's helpful. Is play around again. Not using very much. You can, uh, you know. Well, you can just do quite a lot with very little. <laughs> and that's how it is. You just play about. So I hope you like that. Thanks for watching. Take care and I'll speak to you all soon. And it's for sale. Bye bye for now.